Hello, welcome to uh, 25th of November's uh, solution video for Party Sweeper by Clover. Uh, normal Sudoku rules apply. Also, there are some circles in the grid. If a circle contains an odd digit, then the digits around it must have that many odd digits. And if it has an even digit, it must have that many even digits surrounding it. Um, not all circles are given and the circle does not include the digit. It's uh, the circle does not count itself. All right, let's get going. First of all, uh, for the sake of being really neat with this, I'm going to color. Now, I don't know about coloring with uh, what you like to do at home, but I am a big believer in green and purple. Um, so I'm going to do green and purple here. Now, this one needs to have one odd digit. Hey, look, it's already got that in these five cells, meaning these have to be purple and this has to be green. Now, this three needs to have three odd digits surrounding it. It's got two evens, so that's going to be three greens. This one down here needs to have one odd surrounding it. So these all have to be purple and these are green now uh this uh this three needs to have three greens surrounding it and now we need to have a purple and a green so with that knowledge um what can we do oh there's an eight there two there four there make leaving us a five seven pair um can we tell yeah we can so uh because in the eight digits surrounding this uh it needs to have either five or seven uh because we've already got two evens means this has to be a five because there's no way we could ever hit seven now let's go down here oh look uh this has to have an eight in it uh this has to have a four and this has to have a six now there is no way that this can never be a nine, so this has to be a three, which is definitely going to be very useful in a second, making that a nine. Now, um, because, like I said, that has to have three, we've already got one, two, three, so those all have to match. Uh, we can now put this as a four, um, this is a six. Now, um, this has to have two evens surrounding it, which puts the evens down here. Oh, and I missed that off there. The two, uh, no, that's, uh, pardon me. I think I'm coming down with a cold. So, um, uh, this is a nine. Now, um, what can this digit be? This digit can only be a one, uh, because it sees two, three, four, five, uh, meaning, oh, these have to be purple and this is green. In the row, we have four uh, purple digits, so that's a green. This is purple. Um, and now we do a count here, meaning we need to put two greens in there. Let's have a look down here. Uh, this can only be three, so we're going to put a three there, uh, meaning all those now get colored green. Uh, this is a green. And, well, I mean... Let's do some more Sudoku while we're at it. Um, all right. Uh, nine, five, one, seven, eight, six, four, two. Uh, man, talking and solving is quite hard. Uh, purple, green. Uh, the reason why that is purple is because this has to ha uh, this sees three odd digits, and this means this would this cell would see all four. So that is eight, and that's three. Uh, can we do some sort of nonsense that's kind of similar down here? Probably. Uh, this is six, so we need to put two and eight. Oh, that's just regular Sudoku. Um, cream. And now from here, it's just some clean old sort of cleaning up. Um, so this is two and eight. Oh, nice. Um, three, four, 
I'm not going to, uh, am I going to call it, I don't think I am, uh, five and two, nine and three, eight, four, seven, uh, oh yeah, I haven't even cleaned up down there, all right, what do we got down here, um, so these have to be one and seven, so that's seven and one, five and nine and eight, uh, it takes a few seconds, two, two, four, um, seven, four, uh, eight, seven, and five, and nine. There you go. How to solve it in five minutes. Hope that helps. Um, see you next time.